Hello Swissies, a new road trip is up. We go to the east of Switzerland called Alpstein. Uh, this is a very long uh, road trip. Um, I'm not sure if I'm talking all the time, but um, I'm quite sure that I will record all the time. So uh, then you can see what you want to watch. Okay, so have fun and uh, enjoy. <laughs> changed my opinion once again we are already in St. Gallen at Neuhaus uh, because you know the weather was bad and it was only autostrada highway it was quite boring so I decided to not record because I only wanted to show you some something cool nice so that's uh, why I record here I think we have one hour until uh, Wasserauen Wasserauen is our place to be where we leave our car at the cable car station up to Ebenalp wow look at the, 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 the dark <laughs> on the right yeah. Um, yeah, and then we just leave the car there for for the time we are in Alpstein. Alpstein is the whole area there. A very nice area. Yeah, many nice little corners, many nice lakes over there, many nice hikes and mountains and hills. Yeah. And if we are lucky, we maybe will see some dandelions. Yeah. Soon the time is over for dandelions, but you know, on the high altitudes, altitudes, yeah, they are blooming now on about, I don't know. 300 meters, uh, 300, 1,300 meters or something like this. Yeah, they should bloom. I've ordered it. Yeah. And then if we are lucky again, we will have a wonderful sunrise at a lake called See Alpsee. Yeah, in summer, it is totally overcrowded, but I hope that now it's not, yeah, it's not overcrowded at all. I hope so. Oh, sorry, girl. <laughs> sorry. See, sorry, but yeah, yeah. I'm always tired when I'm talking to you in the car, girl. I think it's why I, I'm relaxed. Because the road trips in Switzerland are so relaxing. Huh? 
look more than nice. You see the clouds, the sim, yeah, I call them Simpson clouds. <laughs> yeah, you know the intro of Simpson. The Simpson. Da, 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 da. Yeah. So it, uh, I think I think these are the same clouds. get a copyright strike maybe when I sing the melody of Simpsons. <laughs> yeah, we will see. YouTube will tell me when I'm wrong. Uh -huh. Construction. Construction site. Learn the piano door. Please let me go through. Yes. Ah, you are a good boy. Man. Boy? Woman? Uh, let me check. Boy. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> as far as I could see. <laughs> yeah, today you never know. Huh? Yeah. It could be everything. So. Shall I spell the names of the villages we, we drive through? Okay, first I have to read. That was Gebertingen. Gebertingen. Yeah. And I tell you now something. We will cross through a village called Wattwil. And in Wattwil is Rasta. Rasta's birthplace. Yeah. Rasta's birthplace is in Wattwil. He has been born there on the 31 January 2014. Yeah. He was like a hamster. What is a hamster in, in English? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I just bought a hamster. And then he became a Swiss white shepherd. Yeah, he grew up there, and then we we um, took him away from his dad and his mom with 14 weeks. Yeah, and unfortunately, we had a bad message last week that the Papa of Rasta died. Yeah, I don't know. He was maybe 13 years old. Yeah, you know, a Swiss white shepherd or bigger dogs, um, they become something about between 10 or 15 of age. And Rasta is now eight and a half. And I always say everything what comes now is a gift. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, so many, so many nice years now with Rasta, huh? And what wheel was his birthplace? Yeah. But you know this already, maybe, huh? The hardcore fans know this. Mm -hmm. And sometimes, when I have enough time, or maybe when I, when we go back, um, then we do a short visit to the the breeder there. He has about 15 dogs in the same house. <laughs> yeah. He's uh, closer to dogs than to <laughs> human beings. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I understand it a little bit because dogs are so loyal. And uh, when you have been disappointed many times from humans, you may be changed. <laughs> Then you buy yourself 15 dogs <laughs> and yeah, that's your family then. Oh, this lost track, this camion. This is not very funny for you to watch, huh? Shall I wait a little bit and then we, we, we have a better sight? Come, ich warte mal schnell. So it's not that funny to watch like this, huh? Oh, warte mal schnell, let them do it. So. Yeah. I don't like so so big autos for me. 
big camions in front of me. Huh? Uh, we just wait. Wait, 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 wait. And then we just go slowly again back to the road. Yeah, I think now, huh? A red car in front of, of me is always a good idea. <laughs> yeah. Red cars in the video, I think this is always so, you know, like so the the dot of interest. Yeah, a colorful dot of interest. Rasta, are you awake? Huh? Yeah, he was sleeping. Oh, I don't have to hurry, they're still there. The camions. Look, Simpsons really wieder. The Simpsons clouds. Oh, I have a chaser behind me. Oh, now we need to hurry. I only want to cruise. Let me cruise. Huh? Yeah, but I think they're all working. So that's why they want to go as fast as possible from A to B. Yeah, we don't have a stress. We need to reach the cable car at uh, latest uh, 15 past 5. This is the, the latest cable car. Quarter past 5. That's 15 past 5. Quarter past 5, last cable car up to Ebenol. And then Ah, then I do something I've, I've never did before. We will stay overnight in the uh, restaurant hotel Asher. Asher is built in the rocks. Yeah, you maybe saw it a thousand times on Instagram and Facebook and everywhere. And it was uh, also on the newspaper of National National Geographic and then after this <laughs> after they they were on the front side of National Geographic it was overcrowded yeah because everyone wanted to see this place and yeah doing pictures and you know so the this this stuff and then they had a little bit of problems there <laughs> too many people and yeah and then the owner changed I think about two or three years ago or two no yeah two or three years and uh, but now it's working I don't know they have another concept and I don't know they do something different and uh, yeah I don't know how, how the, the locals feel now because the locals were fans of the, the old owners but yeah sometimes it needs some time and then yeah everything will be fine again yeah it's always like this in Switzerland you know when something is coming new in some areas or someone even persons <laughs> uh, is coming into an area where yeah, where they are used to it, like, you know, nine to five, and we always did it like this, and um, yeah, it's sometimes, it's very difficult to, to bring new ideas. Yeah. Es ist Yeah. So first they say, no, ist nicht So, uh, translated, it means it's bullshit. So this is the first thing they say. Or they think sometimes, they only think and look at you like you are the most stupid person in the whole wide world. But um, then after you told them 200 times, <laughs> yeah, they, they begin to, to change their minds sometimes. Yeah. We call it in, in German, we say, Steter Tropfen höhlt den Stein. Huh? So, uh, drops is, how you say it in English? Pff, I don't know. Steht drop von Höldenstein. Many drops are, are making the hole in the stone. <laughs> you know what I mean? 
Yeah. Ja, yeah, you know what I mean. You know, you understand me. Das finde ich eben schön an euch. Hä? You understand me. Ja. Ja, das ist always when. Ja, yeah, especially on the countryside, you know. Es ist so in, 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 the, in the cities there is always some change, you know. Yeah, this house is rebuilt and this is renovated and this is a new restaurant opening and so this is quite of normal. When, but when you do something new on the countryside, yeah, it's different. <laughs> it's different. And then it depends on the canton where you are. Because we have man, many cantons. We have 27, 26, I don't know. Many cantons and then we have half cantons. <laughs> Yeah, it's this yeah, uh, difficult political system, you know. So every canton has his own politics, and yeah. And I have no idea of politics, so I, I don't tell more about politics now. <laughs> I only wanted to tell you that Switzerland is not Switzerland, just Switzerland. No, it's Canton Wallis and Canton Bern and Canton Appenzell, and yeah. And in many cantons you have a thousand other opinions. Yeah, so it's just... Oh, how nice it is right now. Huh? It looks like in the Teletubby land. You know Teletubby? Huh? I think that was the worst TV show for children. <laughs> la la, Lulu, or whatever it was. I don't know. I don't know. But it looks like Teletubby land. Yeah, maybe it was psychologic, psychologic wertful, um, useful for children. I don't know, but I know I, I, I preferred we had when I was a, a child, so about two or three years ago. <laughs> um, I used to watch the TV show, TV show, um, the Sendung mit der Maus. Yeah. It was called the TV show with the mouse, and there was a mouse, of course, in the TV show. <laughs> uh, not a real mouse. It was a comic mouse. It was a comic mouse. What's the name of the mouse? Mouse? I don't know. I think so. Yeah, just yeah. What's the name of the mouse? Not mouse. Nach oh, 400 Metern liegen Sie im Kreisverkehr links. Okay, I do that. I do that. Yeah, say no with the mouse. And in this TV show, you learned so many things. You know? Like how to, I don't know, drink orange juice. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Useful things from the daily living for children. Explained for children. Yeah. Say no with the mouse. But tell it, Toby. I don't know. Biegen Sie im Kreisverkehr links ab. But uh, maybe I, I, I'm just too old for that. So I don't understand the, the meaning of, of all this. Maybe. I loved to watch uh, TV shows like this. Am I am right for Luther's Schnurre? Yeah, no, I'm not right. Ja, ist klar. Ja, ja, we, we come to the same place. Uh, where was I? Yeah, inside the photo of I lost the... <laughs> I would say photo. Hey! Yeah, I lost the connection of uh, what I was talking about. I think it was a TV show with the mouse and then, yeah. And even, and even don't know why I'm, I'm talking about this. Yeah? It's a schwank about my childhood. <laughs> ah. Yeah, daddy with his children and the woman. So also, we are übrigens, we are think, I think we are in Wattwil now. Yeah, Wattwil, yeah. Remember, birthplace of Rasta. But we do not, um, we do not visit his, uh, his breeder. Metern biegen Sie im Kreis 
Straßenverkehr links ab. Aha. Zweite Ausfahrt. Ja, yeah, I think Dann I can stop her now. Sie links so. ab. Wow. Yeah, what will? This is in Kanton uh, St. Gallen, I think. Ja. Yeah. St. Gallen. <laughs> yeah, I'll. Yeah, sorry for the St. Sankt Gall people watching. Sie im Kreisverkehr links But you know the Zurich people, Dann they... Sie links ab. Come on, we stop it as well. We stop the girl. We stop the girl. And um, yeah, the Zurich people always uh, make jokes about the other um, dialects of the other cantons. And of course, the other cantons <laughs> always make jokes about Zuri people or Bernese people or... Hey, what? Yeah, so um, they imitate the, uh, the, the, the dialect of uh, St. Gale. <laughs> yeah, because, yeah, St. Gale, zum Beispiel, for example, St. Gallen, they are, they have um, quite um, so, but uh, they are quite, how you say, yeah, they have their own language, punkt, yeah, and uh, for a Zurich person, it sounds maybe funny, and then they imitate them, so St. Gallen, they're going to St. And in Appenzell, where we are, uh, in a few hours, they have a really special uh, dialect. And sometimes I, I need uh, a few minutes or sometimes hours to understand what they say. Yeah, because it's, yeah, it's nearby St. Gallen, but it's totally different. They spell every word totally different. And then you have to be concentrated to understand what they what they really mean. Yeah. So that's why. Oh, we have red light. Ah, doch nicht. Not yet red light. We have police behind us. I always have a bad feeling when police is behind me. I don't know why. I do nothing wrong, but you know this feeling? Yeah. Don't like it. It's like a chaser. <laughs> yeah, but um, maybe I shouldn't talk. Maybe they watch me, how I talk to you. I don't know. I am a little bit silent now. Because maybe they think I'm uh, I'm talking to my phone. I don't know. Let's have a look where they go. Am I the only one of this feeling? That would be interesting. Huh? <laughs> I was once in St. Gallen. <laughs> Yeah, maybe should be some colors in. I was once in St. Gallen. I had a, a talk with a wedding couple. Uh, just a minute. I have to go straight. I had a talk with a with a wedding couple, and uh, then I drove home. And you know, St. Gallen is quite. Um, it's quite a, a complicated city to go by car. Should I have 60 or 50? They stop me because I'm driving too slow. <laughs> I don't know. Um, let me check. What am I going to look at? How fast am I I can't see it on my on my dojo. 50 or 60? I drive 55. Then I'm I'm on the safe side. <laughs> Yeah, I was in St. Gallen and then I wanted to go home after this uh, after this um, talk with the, the wedding couple. And I was in a, yeah, I didn't look in the mirror, you know, where you can see a car. And 
then I saw a police car behind me and bling bling and with the, the, the you know the lead lead with the words please stop <laughs> and um, yeah, then I stopped and they said did you know that you took a wrong way and I said no I didn't know <laughs> yeah and I, I took a wrong way in St. Colin somewhere and they wanted to tell me that I was wrong yeah <sighs> police is gone <laughs> I was a little bit of <laughs> yeah I, I, I think you, you you felt it girl I don't like it when the police is behind me but she's gone Woo! <laughs> I'm back in the game <laughs> yeah yeah and then they were talking to me so yeah you were wrong and you, you took the wrong way and papi and papo and that would cost about 250 Swiss francs and this is a lot 250 Swiss francs this is really pff, no and then I said but you know I just I just had to talk about a wedding Ah, oh, about the wedding so it's no problem so you can go home now <laughs> and they they thought that I was talking about my wedding so they were kind to me and said okay go home and invest the money for your wedding <laughs> Yeah, that was cool. So there, that was a nice police. Hmm? But um, yeah, sometimes they are not nice. And, and I think this is the reason that I don't like it when a police car is behind me. So you never know, are those nice guys or not? I should see mine. So, but I, I, uh, now I am relaxed more. <laughs> Without any chaser behind me, we have now the, the good part of the, of the road in front of us. The interesting part of the road. Timing is good. We have still uh, two hours left before the last cable car is going up. So, no worry. <clears throat> Cutting the trees, maybe. I oh, know. Moving stones. It's like Rasta. <laughs> the bigger, the bigger version of Rasta. He's moving the stones out of the rivers and the lakes. Yeah. That was the big version of it. That's why Rasta thieves, thieves. Yeah, thieves are a kind of cotton. Yeah. He, he wouldn't survive without me. <laughs> he, would, he couldn't kill any animal with his teeth. He would eat yogurt all the day. <laughs> yeah. And muesli. You know muesli? Birche muesli? Yeah, this is also a typical... Typical Swiss... Swiss breakfast food. Yeah. Birche muesli. Muesli. I think it's Swiss. I'm quite sure it's Swiss. Oh, look now. Wow, it looks like, huh? Tell it to me again. Mm. It's, it's good that I recorded that late. Huh? So we have so much, so much more to see. Wasser flu, 848 meters above sea level. It doesn't look like this. It doesn't felt like this. But yes, well, you can see it on the animation uh, which I put in the video um, when it began. What do you think about this animation? I love it. Huh? So you can see from where we came and to where we go. A big thank, uh, our mouse junkie, one of my uh, abonnenten. One of my subscri sub subscriber subs yeah subscribe <laughs> subscribers on yeah made the input and said hey Sylvia we love watching your videos but we don't know where you are and I said yeah that makes sense no that makes no sense <laughs> yeah and then I 
I checked for for a tool or an app to yeah to create something. And the first thing is Google Earth that zooms in. Then you can see which way you have to take when you are lost in the universe. So yeah, then you can say, ah, I want to go here. Then and they beam you on the exact place where you uh, tagged the, you know, where you tagged the place, logische Wies. And then the other thing is to, to show you where, which way we, we took. So the 3D animation of a road trip, I love that. So you can see clearly where, yeah, which villages we, we passed through and... I think this is a good idea. So thanks again to Mouse Junkie for the input. I learned with you. Hmm? If you check my... <laughs> my first videos I've uploaded on YouTube I just thought yeah yeah I do a little bit of YouTube now too <laughs> yeah and then yeah then you do do the entwickler right then you you get better and, and better hopefully <laughs> I don't know yeah my goal is to, to show you the interesting side of Switzerland and to um, tell you a little bit more about the background of Switzerland or yeah not only the, the main stuff you, you can read in the newspapers or in the in the Reise Magazine in the travel magazines yeah it's actually nice. behind the scenes stuff hey careful girl now we are in Brunnadere Brunnadere I don't know how they spell it. They surely spell it differently. Pronotera. Pronotera. I don't know. Pronotera. Pronotera. Yeah. We are on the right way. I, ooh, a little too fast. Has you seen a Yeah. Lightning box. Or how you say, how you call them? The lighting box, I don't know. A Blitzkosten. We call them Blitzkosten. Yeah. They do pictures for free in the first sight. <laughs> but then you get uh, mail and then they said, hey, you were too fast. That costs. And I think when you drive too fast in the orts, in, in the village, like this, where it's uh, 50, 50 uh, speed, when you have, uh, I don't know, 10 too much, it's I think 120, something like this. And if you are too fast in a 30 zone, it's even more. Yeah, it's better you go by foot there. <laughs> yeah, instead of, of uh, driving too fast in a 30 zone, it's not worthy. No. It's not worthy anyway to to drive too fast in Switzerland, it's, it's too expensive, to be honest. Yeah. So, what are we here now? We're in a brunatere. Brunatere. They will hate me, how I spell it. We need some sunlight, where is the sun? Hello? They're cutting the grass everywhere. Time for hay fever. No. So now it's eight again. You have to keep uh, um, spend attention on the the architecture in this canton. I don't know if we are already already in Canton Oppenzell. I don't think so. We are still in St. Gallen. And uh, but also here the houses are totally different built. Huh? When you compare it now to Bernays Overland, well, this is a new one. You, you have to ignore this one. But uh, yeah, maybe I see we see some typically um, Saint Gall uh, countryside houses. I'm quite sure we will see them. I 
think oh look on yellow meadow oh i'm so hoping that we see some flowers at the at the area we we go for the next three days or four days one day tuesday wednesday thursday three or four days four days three nights or four days yeah because you know after this the cows are coming on the meadows sankt peterzell is this uh, the cows are coming to the meadows and then everything is nicht mehr so schön. Meadows are not nice anymore because they, 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 they produce, you know, what comes out behind them. Yeah. What's on the field here on the right? <laughs> yeah. So on the meadows uh, doesn't look uh, nice then. So it's a short time that the yellows are filled with flowers and then you have to go there, otherwise it's gone. Well, with cows it's, it's, it's also nice. Look now, we have a typically uh, some color or open cell house, this style. Yeah? It's not schön, gell? It's not bad, that bad. <laughs> These are some locals. Do you remember Stammtisch? <laughs> that was one. Huh? Uh, I told you about Stammtisch in one of my my latest videos, where the same people meet each other at the same place and drinking the drinking for hours, and then they forget forget again what they were talking about. That's Stammtisch. Look, another old house here. You see it? With the nice, um, how do you say? Verzierige uh, art, art on the, on the wall. Yeah, it's different. <coughs> it's different. And um, if you want to, to buy a house like this and you say, oh, come on, yeah, it's, yeah, price is good and I buy it <clears throat> and you want to renovate this house be aware <laughs> because you have many um, restrictions yeah because of uh, Heimatschutz I don't know how it is called in, in, in English Heimatschutz is the company which um, looks that um, historical houses yeah um, do not get lost so that when you renovate it <clears throat> that you keep the the historic stuff in the house and this costs my dears yeah this is very expensive so you have to think twice if you want to buy a house like this and then to renovate it because you have to um, follow all these rules uh, sometimes then it's better to buy a new house <laughs> yeah it, i think it, it's a good thing you know to um to keep the 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 history of the ar architecture alive when you have money when you don't have money schwierig no So it is. I think we have now half an hour <clears throat> and then uh, we should be at Wasser Auen. Yeah, yeah it's a, a very hilly, <laughs> hilly, hügelig. You say hilly when there are many hills? I don't know. Sometimes there are words that you that I think they are right and then they have a totally other meaning. <laughs> yeah. So I I say there are many hills here because this is correct. I know that. So eighty again. You see the white uh, bubble ding dong rolls? <clears throat> this is the the cotton grass. Yeah. So they 
they keep it for uh, winter that the cows have food I think so it's for winter yeah I'm quite sure because in summer the cows are almost gratis <clears throat> they eat by themselves on the Alps so it's not only that uh, the farmers think they have a good life up there <laughs> it's also that they think it's cheaper <laughs> it's cheaper that the cows can eat on the Alps yeah for sure and I think it's also good for the, the, the ground yeah they say I don't know what is the truth <laughs> no one knows what is the truth yeah because there are different truths right yeah everyone has his own truth yeah go 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 <clears throat> so yeah good um, yeah I think I'm gonna go You see, RE <laughs> normally RE the 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 number of the car normally RE are rental cars. So when you see an RE, it is up until Innerroden, and when you see an RE in Venezueland, it's um, <clears throat> mostly a rental car. Mostly are tourists in there, so you have to be a little bit uh, patient. Because when tourists are driving in a Bernays overland or in some other nice areas, they have a lot, lot to watch. They watch on the left and they watch on the right and <clears throat> they are not very concentrated on the road. So be aware when you have a RE in front of you. Pop, 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 pop. Mm. No, no, I'm kind. I was good. <laughs> Ja, da war nicht so zart. Hast du schon Candy oder no? No? Kein Zart? Ein Candy. Ja. Wenn ich too much too much like, like on the road trips, I become thirsty. <coughs> And if I have nothing to drink, I eat Zart. But I have something to drink. Yeah. Yeah, we need to drink more. <clears throat> yeah, better now. Much better now. Are we already in open cell? Not yet, huh? Still in the canton of St. Gallen, I think. <clears throat> I'm not sure. Normally, when you change the canton, there is a sign spot, a big one with the uh, with the flag, you know, of the canton, because every canton. Of course, has its own flag. Wappe, you say that? Wappe, shield. I think so. Has its own shield. And um, mostly there are some animals on it. In Bern, it's a, a, ba a beer, a bear, not a beer. <laughs> Nothing to drink. It's a bear. Yeah, in Compton Bern, it's a bear. What is in St. Gallen? I don't know. We will see. I'm so sorry, but I don't know all the all the flags out by heart. For the, the movie it's cool 
well, we have some some nice clouds, but a little bit of sunlight would be nice. It doesn't look like sunlight today. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow we have a nice sunrise. Yeah. At Asher. By the way, we have um, very, very hot temperatures this week. I'm not sure, but yesterday was the hottest day uh, which has been re recorded ever since they record the, the temperatures uh, in Switzerland. The hottest day ever in my role. Yeah, I'm quite sure it's, it's because of the climate change. We can't lie anymore. Huh? So, where are we? This is... Waldstadt. Ah, a friend of mine lives here somewhere. Or lived here. I made the, how you say, Ausbildung. I mastered, I can't even say it. Yeah, but <clears throat> then you understand what I mean. I studied, studied, um, how you say, um, hi, hi, hypnose, hypnose, hy, hypnotic, I don't know. How to hypnotize, <laughs> hypnotize. <laughs> <laughs> or mesmerize, I don't know how to hypnos hypno hypnosia hypno hypnotisia hypno I don't know the word I'm so sorry to hypno hypnosize someone <laughs> I'm sure there is another word but yeah oh just a minute I need to check where we go I think we have to go there through the through the Kreisel <clears throat> And uh, then, yeah, here we are, right? Yeah, I studied this once for about one year. And uh, on the paper, I could hypnotize someone, but I cannot. I'm too hibbly. I'm too, too nervous for that. And the, yeah, why I'm talking about this, the, the friend I know which, uh, who is living here, that he was in the same class. So, schwankers im Lappen, huh? Things you don't need to know. <laughs> yeah, so now... Now we go into the direction of Appenzell. You see it on the sign spot? Yeah. Whoa. I think we, st we are still in the Canton St. Gallen. Or are we, are we already in Canton Appenzell? Ah, I think so, huh? I didn't see the, the, the shield or the sign spot, but yeah, I think we are already in Appenzell. Oh, yeah. It's not a big difference. The biggest difference is uh, the, the dialect. Yeah. And maybe the houses, which you see soon, they are even more um, historical. Yeah, you will see. You will see. When I lived in Winterthur, I was very often in this area because it's one hour away from Winterthur. Winterthur is nearby Zurich. Zurich is, uh, I don't know, somewhere in Switzerland? <laughs> yeah, but okay, Winterthur is nearby Zurich. Zurich is a, is a quite big city and uh, but it's not the capital city. The capital city is Bern. 
Mm. Ah, Appenzell. Now you saw it. Ah, er. Und will. Appenzell. Mm. What I wanted to tell you. Oh, du hast das Fernlicht an, Schatzi. Ähm. Ich habe schon wieder den Foto verloren. I forgot. Ma. Ma. Ich habe den Foto verloren. You know, when I'm talking so much, I have no time to think. <lacht> Aber das ist nicht so schlimm. Das ist nicht so schlimm. So, we are now in. You see the houses? Really old school. Huh? And all the restaurants is, are called like Bären und Schwane und Sterne und Krone. Ja. Yeah. That would be interesting to to dive into the historical beginning of all this. Hmm? How they named the restaurants and the hotels and why it is called about this animal and Loje, Loje lions. There are many hotels and restaurants called lions. We have no lions in Switzerland. Huh? So why are, why are they called lions? Well, we even don't have be well, bears. Well, we have some bears in some areas. Home Hans Werner. <laughs> Hans Werner is from Bern. He, he don't have any hurry. <laughs> yeah, this is what the Zurich people uh, are uh, when, uh, doing jokes about Bernese people that they are too slow. But I think I told you this once. Yeah. So now, Rasta soon, soon. Yeah, Rasta is sitting in the front of the car. You get bored already, huh? Ah, in the front of the car. In the back of the car. <laughs> in the front of the car. Rasta is driving, now I can tell you. <laughs> no, he's in the back of the car. Yeah, I already told you, when I'm talking too much, I don't have any time to think about it. And even in English, you know, because I don't... I don't think in English. I think in Swiss German. This is um, this is not that easy. Huh? What I do? <laughs> My, I, I could just do all in, in Swiss German, but, but no one would understand any word. So at least you understand a little bit hmm? of what I am telling you. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah. And if not, you can push the translate button. But to be honest, when I have videos like this and I record now since 51 minutes, I cannot control the trans translator. Yeah, because you know, on YouTube there's an automatic translator. Uh, it's like It's like a, um, a robot sitting behind my video <laughs> and checking what I, I was talking about. And when I am lucky enough, he understands that I was speaking English. <laughs> and uh, then he translated as good as he can, the robot. But some words, because my English is not that perfect, some words are wrong. They are written wrong, they are spelled wrong, they are wrong understood from the robot. And then, then it's just, it's just like it is. So if you push a translate button, please, please be patient with me. Huh? It's not always correct. Huh? Oh, I miss this view these hills. The hills are alive with the sound of music. Yeah, it's from a musical from... I don't know. There's always someone telling me this. The hills are alive with the sound of music when I am walking or driving in an area like 
Heidi Land, you know. Well, wow, that's such a slow one, huh? I don't know. Yeah. Like all this, okay? Be patient, we are soon there. Tell? Soon, soon. And then I hope they don't have any technical problems. Otherwise, we have to walk up about. What is it? One and a half hour, maybe. Yeah, it's not too. It's it's extremely, <laughs> extremely. It's extremely steep, but it's it's doable. Yeah. But I hope that the cable car is running because we have heavy package, dog food, and yeah, of course, camera and lenses and you know. All the stuff for recording nice videos and nice pictures. Yeah. So come on, baby, we miss our cable car when you drive that slow. This is for sure a local. Yeah. So now, can you see the mountain behind mm, a little bit? Huh? The highest peak you can see is the uh, the mountain called Horkasten. High, I don't know, Horkasten, egal. And uh, there is also a cable car running up. From there you could do a nice hike to uh, Stauben. Stauben is a is a mountain hotel. There are so many mountain hotels. It's a really cool uh, hiking area, the Alpstein. Mm, it's not the most easiest hiking area. There are many people falling down every year and dying. Yeah, just to let you know. Um, because some, some hiking paths are quite difficult and steep. You know, you can fall down. <whistles> Zack, Magbisch. But it's a really nice area to hike, yeah. Well-known hiking area in Switzerland. That's why you won't see me here in summer. <laughs> no way. Yeah. Anyway, in summer you, you don't see me during the day. We are early. Uh, early on a hike or on a trip or mostly before sunrise. It has two reasons. One is because of uh, preventing or to avoid the crowds. And the other reason is when it's too hot and 30 degrees, I don't like to hike, to be honest. I don't like hiking on 30 degrees. This is too hot. And also for Rasta, I prefer to go wake up in the morning early at four o'clock <laughs> or three o'clock or whatever and then just um, yeah just having a, a hike a nice one and then being back home at 10 or 11 yeah I prefer this so what do we do now? we right <coughs> No, there are two ways you could take now, but we take the, the one going straight. It's more landscape. Okay? On the right, you would go to Oppenzell downtown. <laughs> yeah. And this is uh, the Umfahrigstrasse. This is the road people should take that the people who are living in Oppenzell downtown have not so many traffic. Yeah. So I think you can understand now what I what I'm saying. <coughs> so now it's written here where we go. I think so. Yeah, even all for Kasten. It is still on the same direction, but then one is going on the left and one road is going on the right. And Hoorgasten is going on the left. 
but we want to go to Ibn Alp and that's why we go on the right. Yeah, they announced cloudy weather today, but tomorrow it must be nice. Yeah. I do not promise, but I think, hey. Yeah, yeah. I saw it. You played with your life. <laughs> It's also nice. Now you, you must see then on the right a little bit. Then you can already see the the panorama of Alpstein. Yeah. See the mountains behind. Yeah, no one is driving now into this direction because no one wants to go up on this weather. I'm not sure. Oh, we were here last year, yes, right. We were here two times. The first time it was raining. That was not really funny. And uh, the second time, I think I was without Rasta. Yeah, I wanted to go back to the Se Alpse and I knew that many people uh, would be on on this uh, the, on this track, so Rasta stayed at home. But today he's with me. Now we are driving to the very end of this mountain chain over there. Then we go up to Ebenop, as I told you, and then we hike down to Asher. About 20 minutes if you run 10 minutes, it's really not that far away. And um, yeah, you even don't need any any uh, hiking shoes, you could go with the sandals. <laughs> yeah. It's also nice going by train. Huh? They recommend to go by train because in summer the parking space there is really, really limited. Even when they do some meadows for uh, free for the for the cars, but at one point there are too many cars and they don't have any space. So. It's maybe better to take the train. It's anyway better to take the train. Well, with a dog it's a little bit different, but if you don't have a dog, take the train. Huh? You have so much time to watch and see everything. Cowies! So we are now in Weisbad. Wiesbad on Swiss German. Wiesbad. No, oh, postal car, I'm going to If you want to go by car, um, the street is um, like this. So you don't have to worry about driving to uh, Wasserauen but as I told you in summer you have maybe no parking place there so my recommendation is take the train or go early in the morning or go late in the afternoon But as a long time subscriber, you know this already. Oh, it's red. So, now I can't sit anymore. You can already see the, the cable car station from here. On the mountain up. 
there. Can you see it? It's it's a little bit above the krone. Oh look, train! Train! It's a nice train, huh? I've ordered. <laughs> no, for once I did not order a train. Yeah, but it has a nice color. It's like red cars. Red trains and red cars are super for the video. Here's some nice horses. Oh, it begins to rain. But I have my rain jacket with me. Yeah. Always have, have at least a rain jacket with you when you are on a hike. Yeah, this is a tip for free. <laughs> yeah, especially in the Swiss mountains, because you never know the weather is changing. And then in summer, it is um, not unusual that uh, we have thunderstorms in the mountains because of the heat. And then the clouds come together on the mountains and have party. And um, yeah, and then the rain is falling down and boom, 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 boom. And then you need a jacket. Gal, look it's now. Such a nice view. Huh? Ah, I love it. Even on bad weather, it is nice. Well, this is not really bad weather. Nature is always happy when she gets some rain, huh? I'm quite sure that we will have a parking place. Ah, still some snow over there, you see? In one minute, we will arrive at our goal at the cable car station. Even all. Wasser hour. That was interesting opening for you, huh? I do uh, another video for the, the hike and the stay over there because otherwise it would be too long. It's too long anyway, huh? One hour? Yeah, that's quite long. But thanks for watching, girl. We are here.